ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? Brown holy water pouring out of the bottle. Like shit comments, got it and then follow. Black live. Yeah, that's the franchise. Pull up every Sunday at seven and get baptized. Brown holy water pouring out of the bottle. Like shit comments, got it and then follow. Black live. Yeah, that's the franchise. Pull up every Sunday at seven and get baptized. You ready? You ready? Pull up every Sunday at 7 and get baptized. You ready? You ready? Yo, 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 welcome to Brown Holy Water. <laughs> Brown Holy Water. I hope everybody weekend was good. It's the time now. Y'all already know 7 o'clock Sunday. That's what we do every day. It's your boy Handsome Lie in the building. My man to my right, Black, get on the mic, let him know who you are. Y'all already know Black success, you know what I mean? I got that 99 moves on me, you know what I mean? 2940 with 29 on me. Shout out to my man, Bash, uh -huh. Tony Allen. Uh -huh. And today, we have the lovely guest. I'd like her to introduce herself. Get it, girl. <laughs> it's your girl, Mariah Lee from Love and Hip Hop Atlanta, the youngest on TV. Hey. <laughs> Also, you can introduce yourself too. You pulling up, you here? Evis Reservoir, the Haitian kid from Atlanta. Oh or my really gosh. Originally from New York. We got a two Haitian limit. Here they go right here. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, yeah. we're already we already drinking that brown holy water, so we gonna jump right into some of these topics and stuff, right? So this is the first topic of the show we gonna get into. You know, like before you get into a nice, successful relationship, we always be like, yo, everybody gotta go to their whole stage, every player stage and shit. So. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? This is the topic of hand. Do you feel it's necessary that a person must have a whole period in their life, a whole slash player limit? Like, you got to go out, basically, soil your royal oats and shit, like they said in it on Coming to America. So, you know, wait, ladies first. Like, I'll get yeah, into it. First. Uh, The nigga is the whole, the whole period. I don't... We ain't talking about the nigga. Talk about yourself. <laughs> oh, you talking about yeah, the just, female? No, yeah. yeah. Do you, you need a whole period before you can be happily married? Uh, I, mean, I wouldn't say a married. whole period. I would say like a promiscuous period. That's the same thing. Whole savage, <laughs> promiscuous. <laughs> That's too raw. A whole That's is to too to raw. Yeah, oh, sound. that's dressing up. You know, you how gotta make savage, it a little How many fancy. savage summers you need before you could? Like, you know what? I need to find me a good man. I mean, <laughs> you young. I really think you shouldn't even find the dude you marrying into like your mid age when you when you can see your face getting old. Damn, so you saying hoe out until you get a ring. <laughs> <laughs> no, until you know, like, yo, they ain't choosing like that no more. Oh, so wait till you wash, then settle down. See how the type of advice crazy. the women that get? Fellas, don't that's go for women like that. Wash, not do dry, that. <laughs> nah, how you feel, bro? How you feel? Man, I feel like... Do you need the whole stage as a no, man? No. Oh, nah, you're a liar. You're Haitian. You know me, Haitian niggas. I know. You're such a liar. Yeah, yeah, Haitian yeah. niggas are the dirtiest niggas out. If you, Dirty. If you, it, if you get it, <laughs> you want to get it from her, you should. You should be good. You should be good at all times. So, like, if you having fun with it, I'm saying I ain't saying cheating. I'm talking about like. No, no, I know, I know, not cheating. You ain't gotta be. Cheating what you doing like now? Oh, I'm having fun <laughs> with you. Oh. No. What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm not you cheating. You being a hoe. <laughs> Oh man, Speak, bro. Yo ho. What you a ho ass manager. Oh, we gonna get into <laughs> all this then. Like but he just said no. He just need one woman that said no ho. He thing. lying. He just trying to look good. Biggity biggity black. Let me know what's up. But what's up, bro? Who knows Talk to him. me, bro. Talk to me. To get back to that. Oh, <laughs> man, I don't know. We <laughs> gonna get to them later. I'm good. I mean, now, I don't know. I, mean, I feel like I think I think it's it's a yes and no. I mean, some people are hoes, so you gotta get that yeah. whole phase out. If you are a hoe, if you went through a whole phase, you're a hoe. Don't mm -hmm. don't get that twisted. It's, that's it's non debatable. It's stick on you. Yeah, it's you're sticker. you're a hoe. It's a hoe you're just you. trying to silence your wholeness by settling down because <laughs> now you're done hoeing. You and know what I mean? People, but you're uh, a hoe, and you can have a flashback <laughs> at any given time. And the other the hoes that you hold up with, they're gonna oh they're gonna come back. Yeah, because they're, they're, they're still gonna treat you like a hoe, <laughs> yeah, even though you're wiped up. Yeah, gonna, oh, when he see fuck. you, he still see a hoe. He like, oh you shit. You snitching on yourself. Tisha, what's up? You snitching on yourself. Nah, I'm not snitching on yourself. Cause you be know. saying your exes be coming around. You just sold you on yourself. Know that, though. You know that. 
No, I don't know that because you, know you a liar. Oh my god, bro. that's not what you be saying. Extra spicy, yo. That's yo not what you be saying. Just don't attack him today, yo. We coming in here. On, we came in here on love. Now let me. I answer the question. I feel like everybody, men, women, all have to go through like a whole season. Yeah, you, you only live out. once. Exactly. You got to get it out. You got to spread Why the love a little on bit. A hoe? You don't want to get married and then be <laughs> curious about other. Like vagina or female other penises and like you want to just get a fair. I said women need at least five to eight penises before she'd be happy to marry. Mm-hmm. Five to eight. Yeah, five to eight. Where you get that? That's Maybe that's look, a lot I won't, yo, no, it's not. <laughs> that's a lot. Yo, you meet a thirty-five year old. She had eight penises. That's nothing. So she, she was fucking since Most 17. Most 35-year-olds had oh, oh, way, way more numbers. than that. <laughs> yeah, I'm just saying. I'm being modest. Yeah, 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 I'm being modest eight. as fuck. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah, yeah. I hope it took about five years for that to no, happen. No, it don't matter when it happened. Fuck that, it, get that out of the way. way. That matters to me, son. Yeah, <laughs> son. Niggas, how I act like they... For the they, summer? Oh, no, no, no. For the summer. That's bad. Five, eight for the summer? Oh, my gosh. You need to tame yourself for the summer. That's even for the summer spring break. Listen, summertime. Summertime. Oh, my God. Spring break, Miami. Yeah. Yeah, like it's girls that came from the time to be a lot of things. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and she's and there. I was in the room. The calm body I was in the room with him when he was about to catch a body, and no, if I, I wasn't, wasn't there, I would, I would never I catch a there, body with her. Look, the, the body was trying to catch me. You said the body. <laughs> I wasn't trying to catch the body. I was around. I was around. I was around. I was around. I slapped the girl. Yeah, you slapped the girl. She came to the room. No. Yeah. Okay. Tell them the story. No, you tell them the story. You tell them the story. Basically, we was having a romantic dinner or whatever at a five-star restaurant. His folks said, come upstairs. You know, we turning up. It's some girls that they pay for jet skis. I was already tight about it. So when we went up there, I saw the same girls. And it's liquor everywhere. (laughs) First off, they was when they said, why are you... You know, they was whispering, like, why you invite her, basically. Mm. And I'm like, oh, I already know what type of game y'all playing. Then the girl sucking dick from the bathroom to the to the bedroom <laughs> to the balcony. God damn. And then it, she falling on evens, like, pretending she let it's All three of them could have got it. And if I wasn't there, ain't no telling what would have happened. I told Evans, get your ugly ass over here in this motherfucking corner. I embarrassed him in front of everybody. <laughs> Look, I was like, get your ass now, over here. Guess what, guess what the girl say? Guess what the girl say? What she say? He's not ugly. Almost. Yeah. I look at her like, no, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. Oh, she, she was shooting her shot. She was shooting boy, her I shot. Boy, I was so mad. I was this so mad. This shit happened in Miami, but what, like two weeks ago? But that's what every female want. Female be claiming they want a dude that, you know, other chicks want too. They don't want nobody that nobody want. Yeah. So then when you get somebody that every that other people yeah. want, the fuck? This is what they you asked for, <laughs> motherfucker. They be mad. They're Enjoy. Like, oh, this is what you, oh, yeah, but me and Evans, we have a we have a fun relationship. Like we done did some things, you know, we done test the waters or whatever. Ooh. Like that's what I'm saying. Like there's no need. For no other to cheat because like you damn for you don't you don't look too innocent. <laughs> now you damn sure don't. <laughs> I don't look too innocent because girls like I never realized how he girls got were so about you. thirsty mm-hmm. until like until him ever ever in and out of high school like I done been in like relationships like long term relationships like I never had that whole stage except for one time in Panama. But you know what's they what What happened to Pip? <laughs> that was a short stay. Two minutes for four days. What that was, did to you? No, that was my first time having a one night stand. Damn, I didn't cut my Panamanian four off two times. <laughs> Yo, the girls get crazy in Panama, but that was the first time I was in college. You know how college goes. You, you always want to have fun or whatever, but I, I didn't like this is my first time ever doing stuff with him that I never did with another man before. So I, that's how I'd be like confused. I'd be like, yo, we just did this a couple of days ago. Like, why are you still thirsty? All right, like, let me what? get to the... <laughs> <laughs> the second part of the question is basically like, what age do you think a person must experience that whole phase? Like you said, you went to college and I guess in Panama, you let your yeah. inner thought out. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, the college, like the so you think, 20s. Like once you get 30, it's too old for that. Like you got But you said you're supposed to be thought until you get a wrinkle. That's, yeah, but when you, that's around 30, right? Nah, that's around I ain't got no 50, hell, no. Yeah. If you don't yeah. eat good fish. Yeah. If you don't eat People fish. People don't drink water. <laughs> like, don't crack no, until like Okay, 55. but at 30, you know at 30, who still want to be, it's you know, different. doing that, though? It's what you different, mean? though, because when a lot of people love hip-hop with a cat, so other 40-year-olds still, yeah. the 40 year old still yeah. out there <laughs> doing the getting ill, saying, talking about who still want to do it. it's okay for Carly Red because she likes seniors. She got a lot of wrinkles, though. Yeah. 
She ain't got I mean, she got a lot of wrinkles. <laughs> Under all that makeup is wrinkles. Yeah. She look old. No, she that got that ass, old face. She got that, that face that look like she can't smile. I can't really. see it. She got that look. strong that face. That ass lopsided. You For real? A lot of I never seen that in that. person. A lot of girls got that. A lot of girls. But hold got on, that. hold on, hold on. What's like? Right, what age you feel like? Uh, the um. The whole phase supposed to happen. I think it's different for a female and a man. <laughs> so what do you think for a man? For a man, it's around 32. The whole phase? Nigga, you should be almost settling down No, 32. no, 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 no. That's, that's <laughs> if you're single, though. It's different if you're single and within the relationship. Now, if you're single... Yeah. So what do you think you for can, a female? You can have your whole phase as long as you want. That's you a know, fact. I got a granddad. Not a granddad. <laughs> but I got people around my granddad who got whole phases, like, who still be in the club. Mm. Still be and on bingo the club. night trying to get yeah. the bitch. Yeah. 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 Bingo, bingo night. Bingo. Who, will still be, who still be trying to catch the young chicks. Like, it's, so what do you think for a female, though? What do you think for a female? female? I think college should be done. After you after you get done with college, you should be looking to settle should, down. You should be looking to settle down, get your career straight. Yeah. Take your vagina yeah. seriously. Yeah, yeah. yeah, take it seriously. Yeah. But then it's niggas, pussy it's niggas better. like you that be, you know, better pussy man. That be Why you keep shooting at him? Over. Why you keep shooting at him? Yeah. Yeah. He, he made me mad let before we live. got here. But let him live a little bit. <laughs> Damn, you girl. Can't live I got right your now. back, you still. Don't treat the Haitians like And I don't even like Haitians, but I'm going to take care of him today, man. Yo, Black, They so sly. Now I get why they all. You should, find you, a, you should find you a good American about. man. I need to find me a Caucasian man. I don't know about that. Oh, man. You don't need no yeah, pink sausage. What are you talking yeah. about? <laughs> Caucasian man. Yeah, yeah definitely. I mean, definitely. What age? What age? What age, bro? What age you think that whole phase, even for men or women? 25 and under. 25 and under. For both over. female and girl? For, for, for both. 25. For both. After twenty five, shit is serious, bro. Yeah, my dude, it's it's I'm the, 23 the right Batman now. forever is out there. I'm you understand? Right now, and I feel yeah. like, but all the old females is like, bro, I be laughing bro, at this, it. Bro, the way the way I, I see it is like this, back. right? Like 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 the way I see it is like when I see a bad chick. You know that I, I want you to see her. You watch her walk. You like, ooh, mm. you imagine spending some ooh. of your little paycheck on her and shit. <laughs> I think like. What was the last man thinking? Like you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Probably the last man that had him. Yeah, he, 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 he was he was trying to figure out how to get the condom off. Yeah, you understand? Know yeah, yeah. He was trying to figure out how to go. Well, he wanted to feel so it. Wrong. You understand? Know <laughs> so I'm thinking like this is every man, man thought process. Uh, process. You understand? Yeah, right. You so right now every it. man thought process says I want to go raw. <laughs> then. I'm in a situation where I can't even do the things I, I really want to do to this coochie. Mm -hmm. I can't I can't eat it because you know motherfuckers is going crazy on it. <laughs> going raw, splash it all over it. You can't See, eat it. See, that's the thing. And then you can't go raw because you don't know. Eat that balloon. You don't taste like you don't know what I'm not. It tastes like balloon. It tastes like burnt rubber in there. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of things. I this burnt it's a lot of things you can't do. So it's like. after you take off the thing. After 25, you got to be. You got to be serious about you about what you're doing down here. Mm, what you're down that's here that's after that's 25, that. if a dude unzipper and his and his balls stink through the through the joint, sure you're dealing with an immature dude. Get out that car, <laughs> run. You know what I mean? And if a girl bend down and you, you smell, smell it, it before before her panties come off, oh, yeah. that's an immature girl. Get out of there. How you ain't know to go to your GYN? Yeah. How nobody told you this? Because they ain't got girl. no benefits. They and can't you be go really to rocking, GYN. She really rocking with her head down. You smelt it. You been you been on Instagram doing this shit, smelling the fucking odor, and you try to skip that. That's childish. Every, <laughs> every girl should. Why you talking about odor? But that's crazy. Oh, I remember <laughs> a girl before I sat down on the couch and the odor came out. <laughs> That shit was crazy. Ooh, that, you you got to get oh, out of there. Oh, God. Oh, that's God, childish. That oh, that's childish. Childish. Because oh, they back. got too much people putting that putting that back, bacteria and putting them fluids in them. And so not clean. all that shit oh, mixed up. That. It's, it. like, it's like gumbo soup. It's like, it's like, it's like, like, it's like a whole bunch of rats. It's not. It's, it's not, not a blender. female PHO. <laughs> it's not cleaning. It's not cleaning. That's yeah, what I say, it is. I'm, I'm like him. I say for a man, as long as you single, you possibly could keep going as long as you want. A man is never single, though. What? Men could always they be all come on, think about nah, it. Somebody might. always talk to somebody. And female too. They females act like they celebrate. They out here it's eating like dinner how, every night at five star restaurants. Come around, yeah. you, single. you fucking somebody. They taking pictures with a. Yeah. With a, and, you with on a vacation? R -R in the bed. Who took you to Cancun? <laughs> now you get to a lot of dates to be single. He said they got a lot of vacations with no job. They got a lot of dates and a lot of vacations by themselves on the beach. No, bitch, you ain't going nowhere. Anti social, you fucking Dexter, Lexi. I don't blame them though. I wouldn't upload no, and then what? Then for don't everybody else to hop on? No, don't upload, don't upload the sponsor. Everybody expose him? No, and... don't upload the sponsor. We already know that. <laughs> don't upload the sponsor? <laughs> yeah, don't upload. Because he don't probably like, what? What he look like? He probably look 
it is a couple couple of ways to could look. Do you think it's an issue as you like a single person just dating multiple people without letting them know? I mean, like why you in your host stage? Are you just like I'm out with him today? I'm I don't know. It's no issue because you in your host stage. So I think you know it's an understanding amongst everybody. So you just let them know, like, listen, I'm out here dating. You ain't got to worry about nothing. No, because you want to know how we started. Hoeing? No, we were sitting. <laughs> we were sitting at a restaurant, and I asked him specifically, "Yo, do you have any, you know, other chicks you talk to? Anybody you wiped and I was up?" Honest. What'd you say? I said, "Yeah, I got a couple." I said, "One." Letty. I said, I said, I said, I said, I don't want to fuck with them no more. I want you, but I'm gonna be honest with you. I talked to somebody, but I don't want her. I'm gonna ignore her every time I'm with you, oh. and I did. But when I went That's through your real. phone, you said you loved her. No, no, no. I never did that. I never did that. That was old messages that you read. Old messages. You read old shit. That was like the day before. Yeah, you he was, met I you that <laughs> I let her answer the phone. I let her answer the phone to my to no, my what about girl that time you got me, you got said, me fighting like, like 50 baby no, mamas I never, in the scale No, no, I you never. You got mad baby mamas? No. Never had he had me fighting 50 baby mamas. The girl I was talking to was a baby mama. But your baby but, mother, but the kid no, no, no. somebody baby. And he no smashed in front of their, ch- in front of her child that in the car. Kid? They in my the kid. car. What's up, nigga? That's, <laughs> that's, that's not his. That's not his kid. Y'all <laughs> smashed got, in front of other people's children. That's another nigga people, kid. Fema- females, females gotta make sacrifices. I didn't smash the chick bouncing her bouncing with my fucking foot. I'm like this. <laughs> in front of the I, child. They ain't in front of a kid. They ain't nothing to do with me. You smashed in front of the child. It wasn't my kid. Ain't my little nigga. Fuck your foot, little nigga. <laughs> that's that's my daddy. That's, 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 that's a baby father fault for not yeah. getting a two that's bedroom. So yeah. He got her on the motherfucking section eight list. That's a baby father for being on the two bedroom. Come yeah, the kids, nigga. But he thought that was cute, though. Like, no, I never thought that was cute. Yes, you did, I, was, I thought that was thought weird. That was, nah, he had weird. to get it all. But that was your but girl. It happened. It happened. I respect it. What it wasn't his girl. Look, they'll kick it. the thing with men is they'll kick it to you like it's nothing. Don't tell us the thing with men. You're around three men. We can tell you the thing is. The thing. Right, you they'll kick it to you like it's nothing. <laughs> it is and nothing. And then the text messages show so That's game. Much. That's G. That ain't yeah. nothing. That's game. Exactly. But it's still nothing. It's, what, what, listen to a nigga <laughs> telling you the truth. He, he's expressing his emotion. You can't fake the passion in a nigga eye. Like, listen, man, I want you. Okay, Fuck you, this text. You rather me There's no be, passion in the you text. You rather me be with a girl who I'm texting or be with a girl I'm with all day, every day. I was with you all day, every day. That girl who I told you I was actually with, I was just texting her. That was it. You shouldn't have to even text her because she looked knew. like a stick from Jeepers. Okay, Stop that, throwing shots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> she can say you look like you a stick. No, you can't. No, because if, hold on, if I show hold y'all the pictures. No matter what stage y'all in, no matter what stage you're in, you Black. you you have to still allow him to have friends. He still got to be able to have friends. He had fun with me. Boogie Black. No, but he got to have friends too. He got to have friends. He got to be able to text. Girl, stop going through his phone. Grow up. Stop going through his phone. Text don't stop mean nothing. Stop going through his phone. No, that was only one time. You know if you know when you laying in that room. my phone. Grow up big time. He go through my phone. I know you know. She ain't doing much good you do. Have you ever had a man like put your fingerprint over the... You did that when she was asleep? I learned that from her. Yes. Oh, <laughs> shit. I learned. That's I be, you know how many times I was doing this? That's Beyonce. We be going at it like. She got to get my pinky toe. You know my shit on my pinky toe. If I get caught. Oh, that's crazy. I never thought about doing that. If I get caught. If I get caught. No, you got to catch her. 4-1. So it could be even. It's that. Even slip. If you catch me. I'm the top FBI investigator. Oh, y'all women know. Of CSI Miami, CSI New York. I am. That guy, you nah, call me, is. I will find she anything is, in three seconds. She found, Black. She, I feel like she was like, I, I feel like she had like a spirit on me for a minute. Like, she was catching shit that wasn't supposed to be catched. <laughs> and it was scaring me. <laughs> you hold really on. just but telling on, on, on yourself, so what, you what I ain't catching? Well, hold on, no, hold on. Talking about you, it's old. Everything is old. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It's always old. That's your favorite line. You listen, it's always old. Trust me. Every, <laughs> every, every man's you, favorite that's line. That's some old shit. It happened two days took, ago. It's the past. So it's what? Past. Move on. You caught me from it. We done. But when we a girl do it, it, it's. It's still a pass. I will never be the same. No, niggas ain't I will like never that. trust you. I will never be faithful. All right, fuck that. We're going to move to the next topic then. <laughs> Got to. Word. We're going to go to the next topic because she get it in. We're going to go to uh, side piece etiquette. Okay. You know, we're going to talk about if you're going to take on the position, what's the proper way to move as a side piece? You know, 
Now, like I said, you might be in a relationship now, but you just be quiet and play your oh, part. I was gonna keep going, but oh, go ahead. See, <laughs> now I got side piece etiquette. You cut me off. Stay, stay, be quiet. Wait till okay, minute. Right, right, that's go right. Ahead. That's it. Learn go right ahead. now. Learn all the rules. Learn the rules. <laughs> Nigga, lots talking. There's a lot of talking. You be quiet. Now listen, but like we know from loving hip hop, uh-huh. you was you know what I'm saying as on the show, you was that side piece. Mm-hmm. But to me, I think you broke the etiquette. So we're gonna get down to the bottom of what side piece etiquette. You wanna take on that position? What's the role you supposed to play? So, ladies first, speak on it. You just supposed to, you know, play your part. What's play your part? Just I mean, just whenever yeah. you know she's We're talking about characteristics because if a nigga looking right now like, oh, she could be a side chick. Now you say, No, do she got this? Do she got that? See, she my can. thing was I wasn't even the side chick. I looked at it as he was my side nigga. Yeah, you don't care what you look at it, but we look at you the side chick. <laughs> Y'all both are huge, man. Your views Y'all don't matter. So we in the same building. Yeah. We all in the same building, but we got different views. <laughs> you supposed to be quiet. Okay. You good. know, you play a part. You, you answer the phone. You go pick up what you need to pick up. You go drop off what you need to drop okay. off. Do what you got to do and keep it funky. Keep it moving. Damn, how you just hit all the bullet points? I just, you know. But then you broke all the rules. I played it different. Well, you broke the rule. We don't get to that, though. We don't get to that. We don't get to that, though. How about you, bro? How you feel about that proper? Way to be. For side nigga. You a side nigga now. What you feel is the proper rules, like the etiquette? Play your position, right? Play your position. Keep another phone. That's number one. You the side nigga. You don't need to keep another phone. If I'm the side nigga. You the side nigga. If I'm the side nigga. Shit. On a daily basis, what do you do, Ethan? I'm not gonna tell what you I do. You used to be a side nigga. What to who? <laughs> yo, she, yo, I don't like all this tension. Why she, yeah, she shooting today? She shooting today. Yo, I feel bad for you in the jump hotel shot, later, jump son. Jump shot Sunday. You ain't gonna see no <laughs> basketball, <laughs> son. Jump shot Sunday. You should turn the TV right on. Okay. Nah, proper etiquette. Yeah, you shoes right, quiet. You know, you gotta be smart about it because you know you don't want to get caught by the. Real person who you mm-hmm. being the side to, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. you don't want to get caught. I mean, some people do that. Some people like she she but dropped the bomb on everybody and it made it seem like she, what all happened. Some people do that. Just mm-hmm. like you have a side girl and right. she be like, I'll tell your girlfriend who what the fuck going mm-hmm, on. Mm-hmm. You got girls broken like rules. That. We don't get to that broken rules. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you, know, <laughs> cut. you don't want what that. Bitch. What are you doing, man? Like, what you doing, baby? <laughs> Get out my way. I don't doing? even want you no more. That's it. Like, if you're going to do that, I don't want you no more. Oh, you ain't going to be my side bitch at all. Black, how you feel, man? What's the rules? You was a side nigga before. Tell me. How nah, you move? I, I was never. I was never. You was a liar. You was a side nigga. I was never. She was like, listen. Listen, I've been You got good dick. Box. You ain't going to go outside with me. <laughs> You like, wow, baby, I want to go on a date. No, I, no. I, I was a starter for a long time. Oh, that's a so lie, nigga. I come off the bench. They hit you, I son. I the bench in a minute. So they cracked you off the glass like that. Yeah. The high dicks. <laughs> I need some dick. Yeah, but you, you know what it is? Like, I think for, for, like, for like a dude and for a chick, it's so different. Because yeah. for a chick, she's dreaming about being the main chick. Mm-hmm. The whole time being a side chick. Mm. She's fucking you hoping one day. Yeah, you a this little move right here is gonna say, you know what? I need that every day. But wait, and that's never gonna but be wait, that. Wait, but you got some wait, females. That's, but then that's the dude, on, you got some females that's, that that got a that got a real nigga and still a side chick. And still, a, and still, and, and still yeah. a side chick. But then a dude, yeah. a dude don't ever want to be the main dude. He just want to keep blazing. <laughs> mm. He just want to listen. If he want to play his position. If my, yeah, yeah. If my days are Thursdays, and, Thursdays and Sundays, and bitch. Thursdays. And Sundays. <laughs> now don't try to change my days. Don't move you know Monday. Don't give me extra day. Don't say you got to do. Oh, I can't break my head getting the math homework. You're not getting the math. 60 or 65 is not going to change the world. You know what I mean? Let fact. that nigga get that 60 and learn the fucking hallway. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's a fact. And this, uh, I say, like like you said, you always supposed to remain quiet, remain invisible. Don't matter if, like, if you on Instagram, don't even follow her on Instagram. If you decide, you don't need to. Mm-hmm. Don't be liking, don't comment. You be out of sight, out of mind. That's the main way because once you make yourself, especially for a nigga, once you make yourself visible, niggas gonna pay attention to this and that. And if a nigga call you, 
Hold it down. Listen. Yo, you know my nah, man. Like chill. Even if you got to act gay, no, let me go shopping. That's the sis. Like, but you still could be beaten. But that shit. Mm-hmm. See, that was the, the thing though. with the whole love and hip hop Atlanta. Like, people were thinking that I was the side chick. But my thing is, I never dreamed of being a main chick. Like, that don't mean you're not the side because you never dreamed about the real. But reality. I never, co- like, I never caught feelings. It was strictly business with me. Like, I was really just trying to get the bread out the situation. It was nothing like that. Like, I, I thought I was the pimp out of the situation to be honest it was never nothing like that I already had my own mans I had so you cheat on a nigga you cheat on Ease cheat on me and get mad oh get man. mad <laughs> get mad get mad at you for a get mad at me for a text uh, 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 she like, cheat on judge, you for a text yeah, judge Judy get mad, Judy. <laughs> get mad oh, about a text no he man. done did worse he done did worse getting good right here y'all. Worse. he done did worse I, what I, if I did worse you was on national TV you was on national TV <laughs> playing my boy <laughs> he was on national TV playing his wife like we boyfriend and girlfriend okay it's it cool. don't matter what the what other nigga you talking about your nigga you supposed to protect his heart who protect my heart I don't care at a part, at a point, I was like, when we we was going through a rough patch anyway. Like I was like, fuck this shit. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go big on your ass. That's what I was thinking. Like fuck you. Like basically, like you gonna see me on TV. I'm gonna be shitting on you, and that's what it. That's what it was gonna be. And then like he done eventually got his shit together. Clearly, but I mean that's what it was at that time. Like I didn't care. Like I'm young. We're both like, young. We're both the same age. We young too. <laughs> so you yeah, I was so hurt or? that I didn't really care. You I mean, know how a man be hurt and don't care about him? Mm-hmm. Like she, he cut her off. Like period. Mm-hmm. That's that's what we were on. At but that I time. think I think it's a very good thing that because I feel like most chicks' dream is to be on reality TV of yeah. some sort. Yeah. And usually when they get there, that's it. You can't yeah. tell them nothing. Now. That shit like nothing. a Louis bag. Mm-hmm. They just walk around. They ain't got no money in it. Some they just walk around you. with it. <laughs> they just want you to see the motherfucker. So yeah. it's like, it's good that, y'all, that she got there and y'all was still able to coexist as a yeah. as an actual couple. So that's, that's, a, a, that's a good thing. They still going and, through. You can and see do business. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a she rough shots they at might, them. I, I think this is the type of couple that could cheat on each other and still be together. You Facts. know what I mean? Because we done that? did so much right. stuff too. You said you got and... a lot of bread out of homeboy too, right? Did he? Did she at least buy you some Jordans? I Not bought... even a pair of Jordans? Even stop flexing. What you bought me? Oh. She I bought me this belt. No, not just no. That's it. That, I mean, that's, that's a good belt. That's a good no, belt. No, it's no, no, no. Is it reversible? No, it's not. It's not reversible. No, 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 no. She ain't spending money on a reversible. No, I got him a Gucci ring. You got he don't like even wear. Plus K. I got, you I got, my man a reversible? Listen, I got him a Gucci ring Come that on, he don't man. even wear. I got Check him hella bread. shoes. Uh, it's not even about that. I done put him on so much game, like to make more money. Like that's what's up. That's what's up. That's that's something that's irreplaceable. That's true. Fuck a belt. Fuck some shoes. That's fact. You leave the horse make, of water if you I can't make him drink, right? I got him a whole right? management agency now. Like, Ooh. Now he, he wanna, now he wanna manage strippers and hoes and bitches who suck dick for a talent. So <laughs> that's still let's talent. see how that goes. That's, that's still that's talent. talent. That's they, talent. They making money for what they do. Even so so let me super heavy still a household name. I just want you to know. Facts. And she fit a household name. And she fit these. Motherfuckers fair, huh? They see her there. It's, it's just crazy. She Superhead. got flashbacks and shit. Not the only reason why I know Superhead is because of Jay Z. And no. I think I read her book when I was like I heard about, five years old. I heard about Superhead by a lot of people, though, before Jay Z. A lot of people. You sound back. like you a victim. No. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you like said fast. fast. You made a rub down, motherfucker. I had all the money. I had all the money. You the real nigga right there? She didn't give me a super hat. She gave me a super. Like, a little, a little oh, so she was sucking dick for bread? I thought she was just doing it to get in the entertainment industry. Girl, I'm lying. Just put me on the ball. She's like sucking it up, man. All right, but the next part of the question, what are the benefits, basically, of being a side chick? Like I said, I mean, you, you, ooh, that is, oh my gosh. Get to it, so girl. so many benefits. Yeah, convince these hoes out here to tell me keep being side chicks. <laughs> Yeah, hey girl, tell him you don't need so no man. many benefits. You don't have to wake up to a man like blow, going in on you, blowing up your phone. You can leave where you want to leave. You could go where you want to go. You could get whatever you want to get about the situation. You don't have to deal with like a nagging boyfriend who always showing his. So emotions. why are you saying that and then like, got into a, a relationship? Clear mutual understanding. Well, wait, why are you saying that? Like it's so much great, but now you got a man. <laughs> Silence of the lambs. Yeah. <laughs> She's 
so great. This is you that. can't contradict yourself right you're not, here. You're not working for that company no more. So why, <laughs> well, why'd you leave that company though? Why, what's wrong with the company? It's so great. It's, why do you want to be a main if the side chick position was so dope? I mean, it ain't it ain't cute to publicize. But it's like, for as far as the understanding, I feel like your soul gets excited when you talk about the side chicks. I ain't gonna lie, <laughs> son. I feel like, like, no, my soul. Son. <laughs> and then she get mad at me for whenever I step out the branch. Oh, you gonna work for another car? Yo, you gonna tell <laughs> he goes to another firm. Y'all, don't tell, like, have you ever been a side nigga and, like, No, I'm a wholesome man. I'm a Christian. I don't do that. <laughs> what? Does a Christian have to do with anything? I'm a Christian. I, 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 didn't even, I only had sex with one time, and that was an accident. I was drunk off the holy wood. <laughs> it's just like the understanding. You don't have to deal with nagging. It's just so clutch. All right, like, so answer my second part of that question, though. Like, if you're saying, like, like I said, you're so excited and happy about talking about that other position, why do you want to be in a relationship? I mean, sometimes you got to what hang up your coat, <laughs> your player coat, and you just got to... You know, hold it down one time for the one time. This is a great example of female that want to have a cake and eat it too. Always. Yes. <laughs> always. Um, it's not a men. It's always a female. Why is it not it's okay for me, but it's okay for it's you never guys? It's not okay. 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 He even said he it's hung his shit up. It's so not he's okay. not even. He's he made a stand up. He's about the other he's side. He's about to pull it right back out. You don't see. But I'm managing. I said, he's managing. He's managing. He managing money. Slut. I never said, so, hey, so let's I want your number. I want to fuck. What? I said, no, let's make some money. I want to manage you. That's it. What's your talent? It's not Sucking my fault. Dick, that's it's what she my, said. I asked her, "What's her talent?" It's not my fault. She said, "Oh, everybody loves my tongue." Mm. It's not my fault. That's a pimp. That's not a manager. That's not your fault. Why but don't I you do be, tell you what you got to do? I can respect you, you if you were a pimp because you got to make sure the product is actually packaged that is a properly. Fact. Mm -hmm. You got to test out the product. No, you can't be having talent. He got to get somebody got to somebody. You can't have talent. Talk about this is what I do. You know to test the product. How you gonna be a manager for sucking dick? You wouldn't even let her suck your dick. He got. He got to. It's 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 experiment. It's business purposes. It's for like he got to. It's not any sucking. Know. It's yeah. not a pleasure at all. Why would you sell Jordans if you don't wear them? <laughs> exactly. You don't wear them. You think Michael Jordan gonna sell me some sneakers I ain't never seen him on? So what he if a be football player, what if a football player, basketball player, in my DM, which it was, and what did, what did you think about that, Even What that guy doing? He what a manager. He manages shit. But, I'm but money. I, could promote, I, could, I could promote my services and, and market them with my agency. You can. What? What? Oh, I what can't. It's promote, okay now. What promotion it wasn't okay does a yesterday. football player and basketball need, though? They aren't TV already. It's true. Okay, and what? There. And what does sucking dick? What, how you gonna promote her sucking well, dick? That's, that's probably not her only talent. That's not her that's only probably, talent. Probably, and probably and her selling point. Talent. She just probably told her selling me. Point. You don't even know. If she just told you that's the first, you. I just, I just said, I showed you. If I didn't you show so, you, you so it would have been lame different. And you saw. I showed her and said, "Look, look what that girl just sent me," and she took it defensive way. I but how you mad you was on TV as as a side hoe and all the chick told as a side chick as a side and all the chick fight, told him. I, was, I wasn't girl. a side hoe or chick because that was my side man. I had a whole man at home. And like she had a whole, and he had a whole. But that was still female. a side. You still a side. But no, you wasn't I was the you wasn't, you wasn't, you I was getting break. He the one who hired me for assistant. a job. Yeah, I'm the one who dirty, framed him. Man. I blackmailed him. I'm the one who told him. That's that wasn't proper side chick etiquette. Yep. It was never <laughs> side chick. It was more of marketing assistant chick? etiquette. Were you the steak or the potatoes? Is my question. On TV, were she you the steak or the potatoes? I'm the, I'm the macaroni. No, you're not. That's the side. That's still a side. No, that's the that's still a side. That's the side. You ain't the homo. You ain't the macaroni. What do you hear? Huh? You start a macaroni. What do you hear? It's crunchy. You hear nothing. You always, you always want macaroni with what? With that cheese in it. I mean, listen. Now. No, <laughs> not even with the cheese. Unless you crack, you want unless you crack macaroni. You want a whole main course like that's you. Unless always you crack macaroni, it. everybody Ugh, can't no. make macaroni. I ain't gonna be craft. You can be the box. I don't know. <laughs> Box. You fresh out the box <laughs> with the pound of cheese. I'm the box macaroni. Yeah, she got look. She got look. I'm, I'm, not, <laughs> I'm not even gonna get. He it said you ain't got that Velveeta. <laughs> you love Velveeta. You, you, you love Velveeta. Even stop. Even stop. Even stop. Even stop. She not even stop. You like that little box. She make she make a macaroni extra cheesy though. But that but she love that Velveeta though. You know. It was black. Every time you tell me go to the store, you get Velveeta. Black. What does that have to do? Yes. I feel oh, like no, you no, lose no, 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 no. You lose right, the whole thing. Hold on, Black. What's the, what's the benefits, though? <laughs> the benefits of being What's the what? benefits of being a side nigga? 
of being a side dude is that there's, there's no attachments. You don't got to hear about her day at work. Beautiful. You don't got to hear about her friends. Exactly. That so what's she the don't, difference? That she don't like. You don't have to uh, be on the phone air complaining about something you have nothing to do with. These are all the real benefits because these are the only things that ever take boyfriends yes. and husbands. Being a, sometimes being a side nigga, nigga, you stuff. do got to deal with her. No being, no, being a side nigga. No, being a side nigga. The only dude you got here about is the main, <laughs> main nigga. <laughs> and that, even that, this you know, ain't do this. Bro, this nigga ain't do that. Come on, come on. He wants steak and chicken. Who the fuck is he? What two hard trains? He only pay the bills. I pay all the bills to the side. And you on the phone like, bitch, I'm gonna sit on the third day of Sunday. That's what I'm saying. So what's the difference between me and you? What's the difference? Because is it not okay for me and it's okay for you? No, it's okay for you. Come jump back into the league. Man, that's I don't want to be do. nobody's side nigga. I don't want to be I don't be like side. that job. I you know what I mean? I didn't, I didn't, label, my, no, no, I didn't listen, label myself but listen, as that. But listen, I labeled let me tell you myself why. as a pimp. Let me tell you, you why. You ain't a pimp? I don't want to be the side dude. I was getting money out of the hoe. So how am I oh, not the pimp? He, he was getting money, but he was getting something else. He was getting pussy. He's getting pussy. Barely. Not every day. Like yeah, It wasn't even like that. It was just like once or twice and that's what it was. You would get cheated on this man. He wasn't really cheating because we weren't together. I was doing my own thing while she was doing her own thing. Got you. Got you. It wasn't. That was just No, no, no. Y'all was together. So hold on. How many niggas was you pimping? That's the thing. Wait, hold on, hold on. If you a pimp, how many niggas was you pimping? Because pimping got one hoe. So yeah, that means you, you had a bunch of one. niggas you was fucking getting money out of there. Yeah. No, 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 no. Not then you ain't no pimp. Ain't getting money. A pimp ain't got one hoe. I know pimps. They got a stable. A pimp is the one. Don't so have can, to fuck from so don't call yourself a pimp. Because they got a stable. If you ain't got a stable. I was stable. You always supposed to get you four or five niggas so you won't be tripping off one. I was stable. So you was getting a whole bunch of bread from a bunch of niggas. No, it was. No, nigga. that's. Yeah. You it was wasn't alive. even like that. Listen, you can milk a nigga without giving him anything. That is a fact. That, that is a hundred percent fact. That is fact. But I know and you I always take cookie. it there, and I always you didn't spread. break no cookie off to nobody. You always spread that cookie. <laughs> no, I'm gonna spread it on the nigga I want to spread it on. I ain't gonna, you know. So are you spread with a nigga that that you like work for this chick? It, it was over a That's year a course, so you knew eventually something had to pop off. Like you get what I'm saying? Like if the nah, in the case where we go back to like the. Uh, I've been knowing her for a long time. So why would she you do that? Ain't that like the ultimate me. griminess Hold of on. a chick? Oh, that's the ultimate griminess of a husband because Facts he's too. the one who saw me in and out of the shop for five years and then want to tell her to hire me after. But why would you want to come around if you knew what she was doing already? I mean, it just was, a question. I just want to know that it was. He's at wrong first, too. He's hundred percent wrong. You don't supposed to bring no chick around your girl if you interested in. Especially about have him, her working fucked. on mm-hmm. national but why TV. Why would you do it as a woman? Why would you be up under this chick? And making friends with her, it you know wasn't, what I'm saying? Like it wasn't even like that and because then eventually blow it up. Like nigga, I've been fucking this nigga. Da, da, da. <laughs> you look kind of grimy. Like you look like it did look grimy. If I, I your friends, I'd be looking though, at you like I apologize though. But at the same time, like this happens every day. Like literally, like <laughs> every day. Say so like, it's just the way it is. Like Pac said, some it be like that never sometimes. Be the same. Like I don't, I don't know what she want me to do. Like. What do you what do you expect from me? It happened. Everybody make mistakes. Everybody, you know, did they dirt. Everybody sit there and, you know, point fingers at me on the cast and they done made sex tapes. They done took they Shout out to Mimi. <laughs> Shout out to Mimi. 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 Jessica, actually, Jessica Dime that took her fiance Mimi from a whole nother bitch. Yeah. Ooh, Mimi, Mimi what? Look, Mimi is bad. Mimi, Jessica, Mimi Jessica bad Dime took her her fiance from a whole nother like Nigga, like I mean, I I'm on another bitch. Wait, I got a philosophy moment right here because she just said that that was funny. The same way you get somebody is the same way you gonna lose them. Mm-hmm. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? You can't be with somebody. I can't take a chick from a nigga and expect her not to eventually go cheat on me. Or you can't be the side chick and exactly. graduate into the wifey role. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Because you're gonna be looking at me. you ain't gonna never trust me a hundred percent because you're gonna be like same day I used to tell my girl, yeah, I'm gonna go to the gym. Now I go hang with you. Now I'm telling but you, yeah, was a gym. Like, you want me there fucking somebody else too? <laughs> he so kicked it to the me philosophy like, moment, the same way you get them is the same way you lose them. Remember that. Going on the shirt soon. Brown holy water. Holla. <laughs> <laughs> he kicked it to me like he would, you know, he would leave her. Like that's that's what it was. That's the but, G though. But I was like, I don't want you Yo, to leave going her because I problems. don't want you. I don't like even I fuck made it clear, like, like that. I do not want you with you're a side just, chick. You just a side chick wants feeling. No, I just wanted my bread. It, How you knew he was going to trick bread off like, you? Which involved How sex. much money he gave you before y'all actually had sex? A lot. Like 10, 10 bands. What? 
What yeah. the fuck you get 10 you, you know how much you can get out of these things? I don't fuck that nigga for 10 bands too. Fuck it. No. <laughs> I don't know what lie I don't know what lie talk. I don't know what, <laughs> no, what you know, he smoke. You know how much you can get out of these niggas before they actually give you yeah, like. Yeah, you get a lot out of a bunch of sucking niggas. I, I, I could have kept going no longer, but one thing led to another. We was on that brown You know what a girl got to do to get 10 bands out of me? And I could Out of me? Not me. To get 10 bands out of me? me? You had at least two kids out of me. That's why I laughed about it. <laughs> I laughed at it because I was like, that would never been me. That would have never been Y'all me. Y'all got me fucked up. It's hard to get $10 out of me. But yeah, I think nah. I think that's a real insecure thing for a woman to take advantage of a man that is financially Straight. stable. You understand? Mm-hmm. And now take advantage of him because you know he has this, but he don't have that yeah. that other thing, that attraction. But he they probably be don't have it. the he probably don't have no, Maybe. most of them don't. Most of them don't know how to speak. So yeah. they gotta talk with their money. That's why yeah. scammers are scamming. Yeah. Scammers are scamming. They don't know how to talk. talk. They don't. They yeah. don't have no game. I'm fucked up. They don't have no I'm talking game. them panties off. That's Believe that. Right. Money talk. Bad they don't jokes for you. You understand? If I'm scamming, but if you got money, money's not a thing. If you got money, you can press fast forward. Mm-hmm. You gonna fuck you me press anyway? Fast forward. You go from hookah to fuck. That's how I go. Hookah to dick. Handy everything. What you want? You want this? You want that? It gonna be one motion too. It was the red bottle. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so that's what I'm saying. Is that is that an insecure thing mm. to go after those type of men? If you can't, if you can't that's, conquer, that's a, if that's... you can't conquer a man that's on the rise. That 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 right there is a hundred. Right Black there. trying to drive his own I philosophy. Even, yeah. Fuck it. I can't. It's, it's only one philosophy. Yeah. In it's, here, not, man. it's not actually insecure. It actually made me feel like I was more in control. It made me feel so powerful at the time. I and mean, you know, I'm young, so it's like. I don't know no better. You was more I didn't know no better. I more, felt like I had more control when I was him. doing this. Like yeah. you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Instead of it being reversed, like he mm-hmm. was, you know, playing me, but I felt like I was playing him. So if he came the over, the incident already happened. I knew it was bound to come out. I was just like, hey, how much money can I make off of this situation? That's before, close to prostitution, know? though. So you have you being it's, a prostitute? It's not close to prostitution listen, boo, because if every if every time we was linking up and you was like we was it was an exchange. Then that yeah, would I'm be prostitution, but it wasn't the exchange so it was all the never, time. It was no, not all the time, no, no, but sometimes no. it was. Because it would be like, I'm about to pull up on you in the hood. Where are you at? I'm he was basically blah, blah, trying blah, blah, to use blah. his money to try to just to sway you all the way. Yeah, he was but just trying to keep times, me quiet. But what about the times like he, he pulled up, I, I y'all always, go to a hotel, he smashed, he leave 500 on the dresser. That's, that's prostitution. You gonna take no, no, that dude, laugh. You, you're not gonna fix your face up to five hundred. That's a lot of money. Um, exactly. That shirt is not five hundred dollars. You're gonna buy about fifty thousand of them shirts right there for five hundred. <laughs> <laughs> No, five hundred is money. Don't yeah, lie like that. No, no, no. If five hundred is money, but knowing that I right know right what there. he has, you like, gonna take that five hundred and be happy. But let me. No. Was, I, at the time, he knew he knew how much he was giving me at times. Like he never tried me like that because what he had going on was too. Was too Riskable. big to go. To yeah, it was too God. much. Like, so he had to spend more money because he knew to keep you quiet because you was gonna snitch. I was threat. I was no etiquette. That's no but fucking let me, but let me, side but chick let me, But let me say That's this. Why how do you? Let me say this. You're messing with you young. We dropped them. But let me say this. Yeah, for like, you. Uh, uh-uh, you can't be my side chick. I want to say this for you and for other females that has taken that. Stop trying to put philosophy down, man. For other females that's taken that path. <laughs> My thing is this: If you got a dude to give you ten bands, first mm-hmm. of all, congratulations, Seriously. a lot of fucking money. That's so, a lot. if you got a dude to give you ten bands, my thing is, it's very childish if all you could think about is money, because it's other things to do. It only take fifteen. All you need is fifteen thousand to open up a subways and and, and a little bit of money thing, in the bank. But you, right, right, you but saw my on. story. So, so listen. My thing is this: I want to tell the other fee females that's out there probably trying to do that and they working on their little hundreds first they got they got climb up they yeah. can't they can't just ask you yeah. motherfuckers don't got 10 just yeah. sitting around to give out you know what i mean so you gotta work on you gotta work on 50 dollars first you gotta work on better dates and then you go on to your little hundreds so my thing is that if you're gonna get if you're gonna get money if you want to really reciprocate get something that can help you and your family mm-hmm. don't just get something for the moment that you'll get one thing. bad one trip and it's over mm-hmm. go get go go get yourself a subway get yourself a fucking uh a day a dave and buses go get yourself something mm-hmm. if a motherfucker really got chicken stop playing with him mm-hmm. stop playing i That's don't even thing. i don't mm-hmm. even touch that money he gave me i was stacking up for a club like i, I wanted to order a club 50, <laughs> I think uh, to start it off, like you know, I didn't even need that much because I could have partners and stuff. But 
that's why I was stacking every dollar he gave me. Like I still to this day haven't even touched that money because mm-hmm. I could do something bigger and better with it. I'm not yeah. gonna be no dumb bitch. I'm not gonna have wet pussy and dry pockets. Like that's not what I'm Ooh, gonna do. Every boss. every girl, boss. these girls are out here doing this for free. Every day, fuck, every fact. hour, every minute. I'm not gonna be no dumb bitch. I knew that what I did was a mistake. So I thought, hey, You're not gonna do it again. Why would I sit there? Hell no. You will never play the side again. No. You just smile. Even the Jay Z. We talk about side shit. Even the Jay Z. Yes. Nah. Jay Z is a billionaire. Uh, no. <laughs> uh, no. I would no. To, no. Because at you the end of the day, you just smile from ear to ear talking about side chick position. Like, you ain't believe in the way. At the end of the day, like I'm getting older. And I'm learning from my mistakes. Mm. So, like, that was my first situation that I ever, like, with any type of man that I ever, like, you know, it was bad on my end for. But at the end of the day, I'm still stacked up no matter what. Who says what? I still have savings. Like, I still have it saved. I'm so not, not going to touch it. You're not a broke chick. That's no, what I'm saying. I'm going to be smart about it. You was popping that pussy. You was doing it. You got your bread. That's yeah, it. Yeah, I got what I got. And it, I wasn't popping when it that all the time. Coming, that was I the thing. Go. I would just, like, be like, um... I'm feeling like today is the day I'm going to tell her. And then he would be like, he the one who offered it to me. And then he was but like, But you was blackmailing him. That's yeah, not good. Yeah, I was. And that was the case. It wasn't good, you. but I, I learned took you to from it. I learned from it. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't good, but I, I took learned you to Haiti. from it. Yo, she ever do that? Take and her to Haiti. And at the time, I was so <laughs> Some niggas that put her in a barrel for $1,000. Because he he was playing games left to right. Mm. So I'm like, man, fuck all these niggas. That's what I was thinking at the time. Like, I'm gonna start doing it, dogging them how they dog me, and I'm a dog You're them how they dog. Too young to feel like that already. Exactly, damn. but I'm. You just was there. I'm already. so in the game and so in the motion. It's just like I don't know. I, we gonna get to the next. I topic, had my though. first Hold high on. rise at twenty, so high like rise. I I need like I have to pay rent, like I have stuff I gotta do. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I know how much is What's that shit over for a real nigga? Because a lot of, chick, a lot of chicks think you're just a broke, ignorant chick. A lot of chicks think that. So Mm-mm. it's good for you to clarify and tell them yeah. that you actually have something. I'm not going to. No, I'm definitely not going to look crazy. I get a check from Mona. I get a check from Sierra and her husband. So it was never like. <laughs> I, <laughs> I was never like no dumb bitch. But the dummy is the one who put their relationship. Like, they have a whole family. They have to show that to and, you know, explain. And kids. Right. I don't right. have kids, so I don't right. care. I don't I'm savage. Right. I don't care. Right. She hopes. You could you you you, you <laughs> could afford to be a savage at but this time. Yeah. All right, let's get to the next topic though. That's dope though. I like that. That's way to good exp- explain. I'm glad you got money in. I'm glad you was popping that pussy for niggas with money. You know? <laughs> but uh, we gonna get to the next topic. Next topic is called pillow talking. We always hear about oh nigga pillow talking. That should have been. That's that's the issue. That's the problem was going on. So my thing is, what is pillow talking? So I'm gonna start with this one. We're gonna make our way over to the other side mm-hmm. of the room. I'm gonna start with my man, Black Success. Good definition. Uh-huh. A good definition of pillow talking. <laughs> because honestly, sometimes I really don't know. Like, if you could sit down with your wife and talk while y'all lay down, and certain things come up. <laughs> I got you. All right, but I'm, 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 I'm gonna tell you right but now. But let me know, bro. Because, you know, you right school now. me. Because I school you all the time. Yeah, so help me out. Me. Yeah, yeah, I got you. <laughs> <laughs> help me out right so, now. So, pillow talking is the exchange of. Of unnecessary information. Unnecessary. Ooh. Ooh, I like that word. I mean, thank you. You know, I like that word. Black success. You did that. Unnecessary. That's all you had to say. That's all you had to say right there. I came to play. Unnecessary. You know, a lot of times, a lot of times dudes would, you know, we all have our own personal group chats. Mm-hmm. We all have our own personal issues with certain people. It's certain things you just don't, don't bring say. home. You understand? Mm. I'm not going to bring whatever frustrations. Like, today, La forgot to get the handy. Clearly. You understand? <laughs> you don't blame me. But no. I forgot to get the Listen, man. Listen, man. Listen, man. Listen, man. Listen, man. Listen, man. So clearly, I wouldn't, I wouldn't bring that home to my wife. Oh, stupid ass lie. He forgot to get the handy. Blah, blah, blah. Because... As I bring it in, last week I might have said something. Yeah. Now this week I'm saying something. Now yeah. next week I might say something. Now she start feeling the way about lie. Mm-hmm. So like, now oh. whenever lie come around, I'm she all right. happy, joy, joy, because <laughs> we good again. But she's still man- right. manifesting right. on all that other shit, shit I done. I done told her. her. 
unnecessary. You that's, understand? Yo, that's so that's what definition. that's what pillow talking is. You are exchanging unnecessary information yeah, exactly. about your friends, about your personal business, about how you move in. The only thing you're sure you need to know, the only thing you're sure you need to hear is yo, listen, this is what I'm trying to do, Dude. this is what I'm working on, this this what I'm thinking about and fucking work. That's it. Like I don't even complain about work to my girl. Yo, mm-hmm. I'm going I'm I'm at work. About to go to the gym. I'm gonna work out and get this body right. That's it. Ma, I can't get knocked out. I can't be on World Star for nobody. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Funny shit. But that's it. No that more than fact. that. Because once that's you fact. give up that unnecessary information, she the vibe change. Yeah, and you could tell who does that because they shorty vibe change. You understand? Mm. There's nothing. There's nothing you could do. Listen, man. Community. Like broke it talking, down. I ain't gonna talking lie. Talking is nah, nothing. Body language. Yeah, 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 body, la- body language is eighty percent of eighty percent of communication. Yeah. So once you see the way somebody move, you already know they already they already feel a way about something. Mm-hmm. You understand? And we already had that. We had that situation with somebody, yeah. and the person body language was, re- was was already speaking for them without us mm. even exchanging words. You understand? Yeah, so pillow fact. talking is yo. Sometimes you got to be be easy, I and you know information is worth more than money. And some of that so you can't give out information. Be, some of that pillow talking only be a hundred percent right. It don't. It be it be it be it be off your emotions. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So at the end of the day, that's not even the way you really feel. feel. That's <laughs> what you feel for the moment, my G. <laughs> Tomorrow you just might love me again. Yeah. Yo, black and tough are forty days. And, but now, but you're short. You're shorty mindset already. She already went to work. Fuck black. Fuck she already, that nigga. She already walked the train with the umbrella. It's raining too. And then she see you with the nigga the next day. Like, up. right? What the she fuck? already. So now she out here advocating and 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 talking for you now. Yeah. Now she's telling her family, yeah, nah, fuck black. Him and him and him and him and um, e, evens on and get along. So so now it, it's already friction without it being friction. Me and you might be cool again. You mm-hmm. understand? Mm-hmm. Pillow talk. My I man, Black. I ain't gonna lie. He, he just shut the, the whole, whole definition. Shit down, right? shut, the, this the beginning down. part, man. I'm proud of you, man. That shit. And right I don't there. even. I don't. I don't think that's attractive though. Like pillow talking. Like that's not an attractive characteristic. It's not, man. Uh, it's so man have, I'll get to the second part. Y'all, y'all ain't got. He broke it down, right? I don't have nothing. I ain't nothing to say. I ain't broke, it's the first time he broke it all. He broke it all the way down. The grand slam. He got the first day, second day, third day. My son hit the grand slam. None of us need it. You said the whole shit. He definitely took his home right yeah, there for that one. Alright, the second part of the question is who you think pillow talk more, men or women? So I'll start over here. Women. Women? Yeah. Why most definitely. Cause they... I like look at this situation I'm at now. Like who snitched on me? Or women. Yeah. Like women love it's not, it's who like... goes based off of emotions more? Women. It's... Nah, I yeah, that's true. That's Both women. Emotions. Like they, yeah, they like yeah, hating. Like they, they hate on other women. They like even with shit. the older cast, like they love to hate on me because I'm the youngest one who just entered in the whole filming thing. Like they entered when they was like. 40 senior citizens. I'm in here while I'm at my prime. Oh, shit. You get what I'm saying? I'm in my prime. Senior citizens. Well, at the end of the day, and that's why the they mad because I'm lit. The like, men be the most pillow talking out of all. Oh, mm-hmm. is you think? For a fact. Why you say that? Because they're trying to get the pussy. They pillow talk to get the pussy. And the men trying to Once keep the pussy. Once you already pillow talking, no, 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 you already got the pussy. No, 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 no. Yeah, but not but even that. What he's trying to say is this. I, I, I just want to help you. The men are also <laughs> trying to the men are also trying to keep the pussy away from certain niggas. Certain yeah. niggas. So right Ooh. now, you yeah. might know Shorty I might be glancing. So now yeah. when you get in the bed, you like, girl, you know what? That nigga. I heard black don't even fuck with Brooklyn like that. I tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> he don't like Cody Allen. He don't like Cody Allen. Like he fuck with them niggas in Cody Allen. Nah, that's his man shit, but he don't really fuck with them niggas. Yeah. So so it, it, it be that you trying to keep the pussy away from, from niggas that you niggas. know she might she been, might vibe with. You understand? I've been through it. She didn't even witness it. Bro, there's no many niggas in high school I done been with. I don't even fuck with nobody from my high school. Only certain niggas. Mm. But how many females know so much? Like, oh, this nigga said this about you. This nigga said this about you. But I'm like, I don't even fuck with them niggas. Mm. Like, why are they talking about me? Like, why? What's the point? Like, what, why is my name bringing up in y'all discussion if I'm not even over there? Because sure they don't fuck, fuck with. It. But the it's crazy just, part is, I never noticed how men have group chats. Like, yeah, they do. Men are so messy. They group have chats group is chat. funny. Our like, group, group chats are definitely different. It's, it's not like It's y'all. not like it's when, not, when it's I not, went to college. It's not all day. That's all they used to talk about. Oh, yo, I smash blah, blah, blah today. Nah, all, no, and no, then no, the no, other no, person no, went to do smash that. and they everybody don't know what no, they no, said no, about you. If you're a loud talker, though, when, when, when we do smash you, you go on a group chat. If you're a loud talker. But other than that, the men group chat is different. Men group chat is, yo, we're watching the game tonight. Yo, motherfucking. The group of friends. Now, they don't talk all day. 
It don't yeah, talk all day. You get a good stretch, like the game is on and everybody talk about yeah, the game yeah, or something. We don't, everybody don't just keep talking all fucking day. You be like, yo, what the fuck? This thing ain't got nothing to do? Like, go oh, fuck, do something. You know Why what I'm do saying? men always t- have to tell everybody who they smash? Women the tell everybody before. too. Women talk out here. Women are trying to hide so bad you crazy? Who's fucking them. They tell that they day. complain about men com- talking about who, who they fucking. The problem is if you ain't being fucked, it shouldn't matter who the fuck is men talking about who they fucking. Mm-hmm. Cause people lie on their dick every day, unless it's true. That was last week. Right, 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 right. Back to last but week. If, 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 if motherfuckers is telling the truth, if your name keep on coming up, somebody ain't lying. You know what I mean? My thing That's about the fact. pillow talking, I think uh it may be even, but it might lean towards a little bit more men that actually pillow talk a little bit more. That's because true. Like in certain situations, especially like when you're dealing with your side chick and stuff like that, mm-hmm. this chick should know nothing about your main chick. Nothing. Don't you know every time like when a side chick, goes, bitch, I know that you had a yeast infection last week <laughs> and you couldn't fuck this nigga, so I fucked him. <laughs> like shit like that, like because he's sitting there saying, yeah, I couldn't get no pussy last week because this bitch over here, she fucking going through cramps. <laughs> like niggas be just giving too much information about, you know what I'm saying, when they play that. The, the side chick game and stuff, they tell a side chick all they fucking business. So when shit hit the fan, like how you did, open the door and just start snitching on everything, telling on, well, motherfucker, he couldn't pay the rent because he gave me 1500 Because he done told her, I can't pay the rent. Well, I'm going to tell him. I'm going to check him So everybody but this needs is, to stay is, tuned for that. But this is the problem. When, That's when, why we're saying when is that pillow, taking too, 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 pillow talking too much, though. We got a couple you know more saying? episodes, so probably like June. I would say early June. Early June. That's the point of the matter is... I had, I had to let him have it. I'm just tired. Niggas got to stop... Pillow talking and stuff. You fucking the chick already. You ain't gotta let her know your personal business. And everything. Mm-hmm. Be as much, be as mysterious as, as, as possible, especially feelings. about your woman. Like, don't try to, because that's the worst thing a side bitch could do is. And that's and why we, on you me and him and are going through so much. Your main chick about personal, real life information. And that's she why me and him were going that, through so much because never. in the beginning, like everybody knew what I was doing and nobody knew that I was on Love and Hip Hop. And he mm-hmm. he let all his little hoes know. Yo, my shooty finna be on Lemon Hill. And then I would argue with them and be like, bitch, that's why I know A, B, Z, D. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's that nigga was pillow talking. Exactly. With you. And it, See? that's. He <laughs> fucked the game up. He fucked it all up. It's, it, that's why me and him, like, we, were, we was on bad terms in the beginning. Like, I didn't even care. Because it was like. Just because you don't care, you're supposed to stay true, hold it down. You volunteer for that fact. position. That's a fact. You signed your contract. Don't violate. He should sue you in court. <laughs> You Who owe him money. Me in court? Yeah, you owe him money because it's a confidentiality agreement. If you signed up to be that position, you don't go snitching because you get mad. Control your emotions. That's a fact. Mm. I don't care what you I do to you. Control. control your emotions. That's the Have position you signed up. Have y'all ever had a girl up. who snitched on y'all and blew y'all? I don't. Like, I don't blew y'all get, spot I don't up get down in them shit. type of. I don't. I don't put. People I don't have side in women. Those. I get I don't you, women. Are, you flex I, said, I can tell you a pretty boy. You you I got about no boy. ten ten hoes right now in your phone. What ten hoes? Hell no. First of all, all <laughs> he know he got ten hoes. First of all, all women are queens in my and book. He I don't know, talk to women like that. Look at how he looking. <laughs> Look at all how he looking. Nah, all women laughing. are queens in my book. I don't, know, no, don't talk like that. All y'all look like y'all what? got too many hoes. That's nah, the ones that look like that. Just like I don't, I don't have sex. I'm celibate right now. I'm a dark skin man. Oh, uh, I'm trying, you know, that's I'm what I'm saying. Dark skin celibate. men and light skin men are two different things. Yeah, exactly. What I'm what celibate. I, what, right I, what I'm saying I is that I love dark skin men. I don't. Ooh, I they just people. come off more like attractive. Like light skin men look like they pillow talk too much. Oh, just say I pillow talk. Just say you like this nigga. Don't, don't, don't try to throw no, shots. Don't, don't be flirting with me. Again. No, I'm not. Don't secretly throw shots. No, I'm, not, I'm just saying. Look at my lovely eyes. Am, so am, I, am I not lying or Why, am I black, lying? Black niggas pillow talk? Am Listen, I, nah, he pillow not. talk more than you or you pillow talk more than him? I don't him? pillow talk. I don't have no pillows. Listen. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, listen. I don't, I don't listen. pillow. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's sleeping on a futon. I'm sleeping on a futon, baby. <laughs> I'm be snatching on everybody. Head on the arm rest. I'm sleeping on the arm rest on a futon. I don't even have pillows, baby. So <laughs> don't, don't, get me, <laughs> don't get me start lying to you, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Legs <laughs> off the shit, too. Legs like, off. Well, Legs too low. Have you ever thought shit. about it? it? It does feel like that, though. Like, light-skinned niggas pillow talk more than I don't know. I don't deal with light-skinned niggas like that. I don't yeah. know. I can't say. <laughs> I'm Carmel King of the Castle. I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm not light-skinned. I, I'm dark-skinned in, in the summer. Maybe that's why girls be like, I love dark-skinned men more than light-skinned men. All right, let me get to the next topic. <laughs> nah, nah, hold on. I'll shout out dark-skinned men. No, no, fuck that. I'm tired of that shit. I'm tired of you black bastards. Nah, man. Like, <laughs> just shout out dark-skinned men. All right, um, next topic. Have you ever pillow talk and it came back to bite your ass? Yeah. 
On national TV. Clearly. <laughs> Clearly. Next question. Let me get to <laughs> Next. Next. Nah, but yeah, because you told old girl, Chinese right? Chinese lady. Yeah, and she ratted on you or whatever. Yeah, I should have known. She got a big mouth. Hell yeah, but. I told her that too. I was like, I should have. You still cool with her? Hell no. Nah. Why? Because she downed you out? You'll see. Oh, okay. Mm. <laughs> you gotta stay too. Pop that bottle. Mm. Gotta stay too. <laughs> I hope you did. What about you, Eve? You have a pillow talk and it came back to bite you in the ass. Ooh, like, yeah, I was fucking bite. that bitch, and then nigga went and told her like, yeah, he said he fucked you. Yeah, Why you it never me? bite me in the ass, but it, it, I pillow like I could say I said something about a nigga that I didn't fuck with at all, but you know it, it kind of looked like I was pillow talking, but I actually didn't fuck with the nigga at all. I had actually real beef. And you had to fight after that? You had to get it? You had to get him? Yeah, 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 yeah. Beat his ass. <laughs> you had to get it with him? Oh, yeah, I had to man. deal with him, but it 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 wasn't it that's why I said it never bite me in the ass. If I when I once I faced him face to face, it was a one on one, boom, whooped his ass, that was it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, whip his ass because you pillow talk. Who you pillow talk to? His girl? Huh? Who you pillow talk to? No, it DJ wasn't free. Really pillow talk. It was just like, y'all don't fuck this nigga bitch. Like, that's it. In oh, front you of, fucked his bitch? In front, in front, of, a, front of my homeboy, who I thought was my homeboy. <laughs> oh, yeah, he told he really, him? Yeah, like, yo, this nigga even just say you fucked your bitch. When was this? But I didn't think that was going to get out of his time. mouth. You just recently nigga. met him. Right, 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 right. <laughs> Damn, no, relax. I, I've been in a relationship with him for three years. No, you have not. You was doing <laughs> side chick situations. Man. He was doing his own yeah, thing. That yeah, that we, we just got back in a relationship. Biggity so, Black, how you feel? Did that. you ever... Did you have a um, um, pillow talk and it, it come that, at the bite you now? That's crazy that you even say that, right? One day we did a uh <laughs> we did um me and my me and my partner Mex from Staten Island, we did Raekwon um Unexpected Victory Tour finale at BB King's. Mm-hmm. Everybody came out. Everybody came. It was crazy. Keep hearing about that shit. It was it was it was it was crazy. So You ain't hear about July so, 9th um, brunch? <laughs> Brown Holy Water? July night brunch. Get your tickets now. Get your tickets now, all right? But go ahead. Come back out. Bring that out to ATL. Right. It's going to be lit. But, but go ahead. Get to your store. I'm sorry, bro. So, yeah. So, I was over there, and um, it was lit. You know what I mean? Now, mind you, Mex from Staten Island, Ray from Staten. So, Staten in there heavy. You want to say? But I'm from Coney Island, so my little Coney Island people in there go crazy. My Flatbush mm-hmm. heads in there. So, um, I see a promoter dude that I know that's from Staten Island. Know what I mean? So I'm like, yo, dog, yo, son. He's talking to a situation that I was dealing with. So I'm like, yo, this is crazy. Like, he even talking to her. Like, this is crazy. This is Shorty I just was with. So I'm like, yo, fam. Like, I, after Shorty spin off, I talk to her. I'm like, yo, son, <laughs> Nigga, guess what, nigga? <laughs> he, like, he like, what? I was like, dog, the other day, boy. <laughs> That's the, I, I don't like dash, stuff like that. I swear that. But it was just in the heat of the yeah, heat of the moment. Know, the heat of yeah. moment. I just seen That's her. That's what just they all say. And, 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 and I got called them. You know, we outside talking. You feel me? Yo, my my G, I promise you. The nigga named Eddie Shades. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna. Oh hide. shit! <laughs> <I'm telling laughs> him. Yo, listen. He a real life story. Yeah, this is a real life story. So you know it's real. I, yeah, it's real. I, I told him Eddie Shades. I'm like, yo, son, yo. I, you know, I did, 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 did that. Yo, the nigga turned around and told her immediately. Oh, uh, see, that's what they can't do. So now I go inside thinking it, thinking it's nothing. I go inside. She came up to you. Uh, bu- 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 Shorty came up to me. Wow. wow. Yo, what kind of shit you on? You telling the motherfucker? I don't, I don't even remember Shorty's name. That's how long ago it was. But I'm just like, yo, the whole time thinking about Eddie Shay's like, why would you do this? Like, I told you something, my yeah, G. See, sometimes it don't even be. This like was for your ears. Fault. It don't even be our fault. It, it, be wa- the it wasn't. That we tell. We be sucking them. niggas. Wasn't. We be it trusting them. Fault. It wasn't we ain't my fault. Tell That's what niggas. everybody do. But I we trust lovely niggas. Mimi. But no, but you don't know her really. That's not your friend you grew up with. Mimi old enough to be your mom. Yeah, that's a fact. So you don't know her, and she was hating on you from the get go. That's so, what I'm saying. You so ain't supposed to tell her. You might have to give it a fade. Yeah, you might have to give it a fade. I'm the one who got her hired. Okay. It don't matter, though. Hmm? That's how haters kick it. Haters kick you got her high. You got her the job on yeah. Love and Hip Hop? No, no. Wow. Got her. Yeah, period. Oh, got her got high her in the nail in the salon. Shop. Got her. But she like, quit, though, right? Oh, yeah, that was fat. That was bullshit. Because she wasn't with the shits. But I would have been quit if it wasn't for your husband. But that's a whole other story. I don't know. In the topic at hand, the question. I don't think I ever been in a position where I, like I told somebody something and then they came back to bite me in the ass because I don't tell people my business. Like I'm mad, like not secretive, mm-hmm. but 
I trust a certain amount of people. So if, if it ever came out, I already know where it came yeah. from. You're living I'm not life. one of them niggas that try to brag to niggas who I could get my clout. I don't care what people think about me. So like I already, like I said, I feel like I don't need to brag or make myself feel important to anybody. Like you could have the baddest chick right there. Niggas be, oh, I'm trying to get up. And I already fucked her. But I don't need to tell all these niggas that I fucked her because I don't care. But then one of my right hand mans will know. And only he'll know because I know what the fuck he's doing mm -hmm. or whatever. And I know if it came out, it came straight from, from there. Him. So, nah, I don't think in that situation now nah, because yeah. I don't I don't brag. I'm not a nigga that want to talk. I don't like that shit. I just, I'm a quiet. I just, not That's quiet, exactly but I just, as as I don't, I know, I, I learned how to just. Stay in my lane and not impress niggas because yeah. niggas out here is straight haters. Why you said that? that? You said your right hand man. I, when I said about my situation, I told my right hand man. Mm -hmm. Just so luckily, my right hand man was cool with the nigga who was wifed up with the girl. Well, he cool. Is that your right hand <laughs> man? He still ain't supposed to. <laughs> That's say what that. I was saying. That's why I spazzed on the right hand man. It was like, boy, you ain't my right hand man no more for that shit, boy. He sure ain't know that. That's, I that bet he's still cool with his right hand man. Who? No. Now you can still no. say what up and be if cool with them, but you just gotta know you can't nobody. fuck with certain niggas. That's when you yeah. learn your friends. When I mean, they come down to pussy and money, pussy yeah. and money. That's, that's, that's it. That's, that's the only thing I need to judge a nigga off of. You know what I'm saying? Right, like anything else, I don't really bother or argue with a nigga. If it come down to pussy or money. If a nigga move a kind of way because you like a chick and he like a chick and he gonna move some funny, that's yeah. when you learn. Or it's money. He owe you money or you know what I'm saying you borrow money and nigga ducking you shit like that. That's the only way you learn a man's true character from another male. Perspective, yeah. in my yeah. opinion, that's the only way I've seen niggas change up and get funny. Over pussy, money and pussy and money. Sad. Yeah, it definitely is sad, man. That's how it is. But you know what? Biggie and Tupac said it best. What? Um, money, pussy, and all that. Money holes and clothes, right? I can't think about it right now. Know. They done all all the said know. <laughs> That's exactly what he said. Money Look, money pussy power. Money pussy power. Now you said money money. Is it any oh, topic, Wayne oh. said that. Is it any topic you, you ain't supposed to talk, pillow talk about? Real quick, any topic you ain't supposed to touch on. Any topic that you ain't supposed to pillow talk about. I don't know, cause it every day is something different. Like it's it be niggas like showing me different things every day, like how they pillow talk about, you know. So about you? Is there any topic you want to talk about? Oh, that I want to pillow talk about? Yeah, like would you be like my mother ain't shit? That bitch is that. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> oh my so I'm saying, so is there any like topic that you want pillow talk? Cause they said everybody that did it. Everybody that you want me to go vent. down the line of the cast or what do you no, want me I to? Talk about the cast. Fuck, I don't give a fuck about them. I'm saying like. Do you have anything that you just were like, I don't care what's I would never trash this person or Yeah, these I would things. I mean, I trash my man's all the time, but I wouldn't trash like Yeah, they say <laughs> they say you don't know shit about Biggie, you're three years old. <laughs> Y'all, I do know. Nah, you know about Biggie. Sing a Biggie lyric. Sing a Biggie lyric. Sing a Biggie lyric. Sing a Biggie lyric. No, he's talking. I know all the Biggie songs. Okay, what song you want me to? Anyone. Anyone. Your favorite. Y'all got me stuck. Any I, hook, gotta, yeah. Any I gotta hook. hear a beat. Any hook. It was what? all the dreams. I, I used to, to read Word Up magazine. magazine. Just, salt I, and pepper in the sun with the. Yo, I got hair on my wall. Uh -huh. uh. Nah, I used to say uh, something, something, cop. Yo, listen, I'm gonna tell you right now. You get out of New York. Can't go on the next season. Don't go to Brooklyn. Yo. No, Mona Scott gotta stop this shit right here. You, how you don't know Biggie? She said it was all a dream. I do know I had, Biggie. You in public right now. now. She stopped when we stopped. No, yo. Okay, do another song. They would jump you for do this shit. Do another song. All right. Uh, Rich do Harley another song. You about, you no, Harley do Harley another no, Biggie yeah. song. I bet I know it. Nah, you do it. I love it when they call me. Used to take a big pop. I love it when you call me big pop. Oh, no, that's not what you Throw your hands in the air. That's not what you said. That's not what you said. That's what you said. That's exactly what you said. You said something else. I no, love it when they call, call me Big Papa. Throw your hands in the air oh, yeah? like it's a true player. Who's no, watch Hardball? Fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> baby G. No, baby G. Don't die. It don't matter. As 
long as I know all the little Kim songs, I'm Gucci. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. Uh, yeah, I used, used to do lips to that's your role model. Oh, I got crush on you. I know crush on you. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, how's that up? Come on, team. See, Let's go. Nah, if you Y'all don't even know. Come on, girl. I'm, I'm not singing Lil' Kim. Kim. I'm not singing Lil' Kim. Lil Kim. I'm a grown ass nigga. That's what a about female. Foxy Brown? No, you she can't hear it. They're both <laughs> Foxy <laughs> Brown and Lil' Kim, the oh same type of people. They're the same type of people. Ain't no difference to them. Is she really deaf? I don't know. I, I, said, I said she heard this. Oh actually, she heard this. She, a block. she listened to the podcast. Oh, when you meet her, actually, she heard brown holy water. She, she said, no, then that bitch deaf. She listened to the podcast. I fuck her family. I ain't done. I, oh, I, I fuck her family. I fuck her family. Okay, all right. She listened to brown holy water? Nah, see what's up. I fuck her family. Oh, all right. Yo, we at the end of the show, y'all. We appreciate y'all pulling up. Y'all are crazy. Listen, girl, throw your shout outs out. You know what I'm saying? Let them know what you're dealing with, what you got I going on. I want to shout out right? to Promo Agency and I want to shout out to Just the World <laughs> and Therese Deshaun. He signed to um, Rich Gang London on the track. And that's my artist for my marketing agency, Promo Agency. And I just want to shout out to VH1 and Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. All right. That <laughs> is. Yeah, I'm going to shout out to the same person she shout out, Just the World. That's my youngest brother. Doing it for the Haitians. He's a young kid coming you up. You always say do it for the Haitians. Hey, man. Ain't, ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't Go ahead. 1804. That, you already know what it is. Hope family. Trump sent them all back. We a real family. <laughs> <laughs> we a real family. We strong, man. And shout out to, you know, the Brown Holy Water, man. Podcast, yes. Holly. Shout out to Brown Holy Water. No. They've been getting me that turned Hennessy up That Hennessy done got us turned up in here. They done man. baptized me one time for the one time. <laughs> hello, Kendra hello. Kendra hello. said shout out to ICDC. ICDC. <laughs> <laughs> yo, handsome lot of building yo um handsome fifteen Instagram live brown Facebook yo July 9th rooftop brunch you know what I'm saying get your tickets now because they're all they're selling out fast these are no lies these are straight facts they're selling out fast also uh just shout out to everybody that fuck with us man you know off the imitator never duplicate we gonna keep this shit rocking forever shout out to my boy Freak Elite or my brother. You know what I'm saying? Executive producer slash gonna be soon call host and bring them on. Yeah, get it right. That's and um that's it, man. Everybody stay positive, free, like, share, comment, and get your tickets now. Do not fucking call me on July night. I'm hanging up my phone, I'm turning it off. I'm not paying my phone bill for July. Just so nobody can call me. Let's go, black. Hold on. Oh, oh yeah. So, it's over. Right. so yo, listen, it's black success. Y'all already know what it is. I'm gonna tell y'all a little quick thing before I get the fuck out of here. <laughs> right? And Boris play the intro. Listen to me, all right? A lot of y'all moving like y'all new gamma side. You understand? Like y'all won the championship for the last seven years. You understand? But right now, they got DJ on the team. And Theta New Theta about to take the fuck over. You understand? When I do this, you got to know what the fuck it means. You know what I mean? So July 9th, <laughs> July 9th. The one hotel boutique rooftop <laughs> is on some Theta New Theta shit. You know what I'm yeah. saying? We taking over. You it's going to be lit. So come on the new team because we winning. We taking over the Brown Holy Water podcast. Subscribe to the iTunes Theta. also. You know I mean? Brown Holy Water. Subscribe. Subscribe to the iTunes. We on YouTube now. With us. Facebook. We taking over, yeah, man. we ain't fucking with it. Hats, Hats shirts, everybody. Come get it. Success. 99 moves, you know what I mean? It's my man shit, Smash and Telfair, you know what I mean? NBA players. Shout out to Bass, I'll show that show to you know all that I mean? love on the ground. Two nine forty two nines on me. Get your tickets right now, I have brand new hats next week. Right now, Morris, link right now, get that link. G link right up there, get the tickets now. You ready? 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 Brown holy water pouring out of the bottle. Like, share, comment, got it, and then follow. Black Lives Matter. Yeah, that's the franchise. Pull up every Sunday at seven and get baptized. Brown holy water pouring out of the bottle. Like, share, comment, got it, and then follow. Black Lives Matter. Yeah, that's the franchise. Pull up every Sunday at seven and get baptized.